<laughs> blue? You know, it's <laughs> blue. You never come close. Hi guys, welcome to my anniversary vlog. Um, the anniversary isn't actually till tomorrow, <clears throat> but I'm filming an intro today because if I try to film it tomorrow, I might ruin the surprise I have for my husband. Yeah. So guys, it's our fifth year wedding anniversary. We've been married for five years, right? And um, how can I make it still make it special, especially for him? And I'm a very sentimental person, right? So I decided we are going to spend our anniversary night, day, night. At the same place we spent our wedding night yep he doesn't know that yet it's going to be a surprise i'm just going to you know take us there and do voila or whatever i've not figured out how i'll pull the surprise i don't think i want to drive us there i'll prefer for him to drive so i don't know how i've not figured out what i'm going to say to him that would not ruin the surprise until we actually get to the hotel right so right now a day before i need to pack and it's quite easy to pack for him because even if he knows where we're going to or even anytime we're taking a trip i always do the packing so i kind of know what he would need and what he would prefer to wear so i am packing an outfit that for later in the day if we decide to go out which i know we will and just lounge wear and all of so guys please stay tuned i hope you enjoyed this video and by now by the time you're seeing this video the anniversary is already over so i'm thanking you guys in advance for all the love that you would show me or us in the video that i would actually upload on the anniversary day and the ones you show me today or while you're watching this video for all the subscriptions i'll be getting left right center um but before i go guys sorting out what to pack i found my reception dress and i kind of feel bad that i did not find it or it did not occur to me to use my reception dress for our photo shoot that we did photo shoot that we did because it still kind of fits so i just want to show you guys that my body hasn't really changed much in five years yes it has changed i used to be i used to be a uk six and now 10 12 so yeah it can change but well the material is kind of stretchy so hopefully the clothes will fit exactly the way it did on my wedding this is the dress yeah it was a pretty simple dress um i don't know how i can show you guys the entire fit but as i was trying to zip up the zip spots like it zipped up to the end but the zip now you know kind of opened up and my thumb is only this flask because I'm not eating anything today. By the time I eat, it's going to turn to something else. But I want to see if I can show you guys the entire thing. Yeah, this is better. So, yes. But what I wore for my reception, I'll try and attach a picture from that day if I can find one. I mean, I should be able to find one. So, this is it. And it still fits. <laughs> hi guys oh my god i'm sweating so much um i'm going to pick him up it's now my anniversary morning by the way so i'm going to pick him up at the office he just finished with what he needed to do this morning so you guys will see how he'll react to the surprise i hope he reacts well my husband is weird like he behaves weird he makes weird facial expressions all the time so i just hope he doesn't make it awkward but i'll see you guys soon um so you have absolutely no idea where we're going to right any clue no okay let me give you a hint we're going to stadium road stadium road yep okay and the place is in our past like we've been there before great Good. Huh? You're good. Okay. <laughs> Wait, how come that was your first guess? Yeah. How come that was your first guess? <laughs> Did you search my bag? Did you uh, see receipts? Papa bought me and my mama bought me. 
Did the general tell you where he took me to yes? So <laughs> how did you guess his rise the first time? How? My wife now, I can read it to some extent. Yeah, right. Because I said stay the room. Maybe I gave too much hints now. If I just left it open and say just guess. And for the fact you called back that is uh, somewhere we've been to. Yeah. So is it that we've not been to so many places at Stadium <laughs> Road? We've been to Echelon, we've been to Tokyo, we've been to other places. So why okay, and I said whatever. He gets right, guys. He gets right at first guess. So maybe I'm not that awesome at pulling up surprises. But okay, a brief Q and A. Um, who do you think gives the best gifts? Best gifts. Yeah. Best gifts. Okay. That's thoughtful, or not cost. Uh, thoughtful. Yeah. You, you of course. <laughs> um, who would you say is the most romantic? You? Am I? I mean, I, not like I would have said it's you, but I just feel like when it comes to romance, you and I, like, we don't take ourselves seriously. So we always turn romance or every romantic gesture anyone tries to pull off, we turn it into a joke. So I wasn't even going to say <laughs> you or myself. I just feel like we don't have it, we don't have it locked down when it comes to romance. Um, okay. Who is more of a morning person? morning yeah so waking up in the morning yes and you know just as you wake up your energy is up you're ready to pa, 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 get things done i think I'll, I'll come from the angle of 50 50 i think it's capable because when is uh school time yeah i think that's the yeah. only thing that has made and it's not like i'm it made me a morning person i don't have a choice i have to get her ready for school but left to me, I would not want to wake up anything before 8 a.m. It's like I do not get enough sleep if I wake up before 8 a.m. Unlike you, that no matter how tired you were the previous night, you will still be up by 6. I don't know how you do that. I, I cannot for the life of me. Like, after a long day, I'm not going anywhere. Anyway, guys, we're at the hotel. I'll see you guys later. because I uploaded um, a video where we we're answering questions from friends and so far the review I've been seeing it's been interesting so I want to play a quick game with powder where we're going to ask each other basic questions just very few questions about ourselves that we're supposed to know so if I ask my question and he fails I'll rub powder on his face if he asks and I fail he'll rub powder on my face so <laughs> so I'll go first. First question. I'll, I like to start easy, but let me just put my powder in my hand first. First question. What's my favorite color? What's my favorite color? Hey, <laughs> blue. <laughs> you know, <laughs> blue. You never come close. That's why I don't have a favorite color. Okay, it's true. Come on. <laughs> Let's say blue, blue yeah. of all colors. Okay, Jai, better. Okay, ask your question. Yeah, what's my favorite color? Yellow. Okay. okay. <laughs> uh, my next question. My next question. Oh, no, I did not prepare for this. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's the date of our traditional wedding? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <Men>. Speak Lord. There's thirteenth, there's eleventh. Oh man, I need to put on a Sunday. <laughs> so you don't know that you're not let's try it all of what? Eh? Of what? Of uh, of what? Of um, April. <laughs> it's Scott's wedding that was fifth. 
Oh. Traditional wedding was 23rd. A day after your mom's birthday. That should make it easy for you to remember. Ah! Jesus! Ask your own amen. Hey! Man! I need a very tough question. <laughs> Which year did I move from Ababu to Portacourt? Oh, months. Months. Oh, yeah, I... yeah, yeah. It's not that mine. It was not that mine. Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's why they say you guys never listen. <laughs> But we take it all in, every information. Hey. Okay. Mm -hmm. Next question, which I know you will not get. What's my blood group? Oh. <laughs> you said your own. We're not the same now. I thought we were the same. <laughs> hey. So like, there's anyone that's here there? I need to point you three times on what you've bought me. Hey, this question, eh? Hey, Jesus. Mm. Mm. Okay, ask your question. Mm. <laughs> Before we went to Christmas last, last, last year, mm -hmm. which other month did I go to see my parents? Together or alone? Alone. Oh, this is up. <laughs> Give me a powder. Wait. Hey. I know we went together in October. See, you have only three seconds to answer. Hey, I did not give you time. <laughs> alone. Uh, when did you go? First of all, what took you? See, you have three seconds. One, June. two, thank God. Oh, yeah. You don't want I. <laughs> Where was it? Hey, I'm not on this table. Should I run for <laughs> It's okay, I think. Where was it? When did you go? September. I don't think it's September, but I was like, I'm not sure you traveled September. Whatever. Um, my next question. Okay. When you... okay. Which is my last, by the way. Oh, uh, okay. Uh. My last question. Is what time was Nora born? Time, the exact time she was born. It's on her birth certificate. Hey. Time. But you mean exact time, not hour. I can't get the full minute now. He, he's minute. there, he's on record. Our minute. Yes, that he was said loudly. Just pour me that. powder. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you say, ah, what will you say? I think one o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> one o'clock a.m. or p.m.? A.m. Then they call me. Come in. <laughs> <laughs> it was 11 14 p.m. Mm, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's so, I'm about uh, your last question. 18 minutes late. Mm -hmm. Last yeah. What's the name of the assistant doctor? Mm -hmm. You do you know? Don't I know. Ask what you I know. I know his name. Somebody that I saw the other day at the market. I don't like no assistant doctor. Though. You should know. I was in was pain. Helpful. I was in labor pain. Yeah. Then yeah. how will I know name of doctor? Just rub what you want to rub. Let's be on record that. <laughs> I know him better than he knows me. <laughs> See you guys later. It's um it's been a few hours, but we're heading out now for a night out. I don't know where exactly we're going to or how long we'll
hi guys oh <clears throat> i feel like i sound weird <laughs> um i'm wearing glasses because i don't want to show you guys the horror that is happening with my eyes i look like i have not slept at all in a year well i've not slept well in three years so for that story for another day last night was was litty litty <laughs> but um I'm sure by now you guys have seen a few clips. I didn't film much because one, I wanted to enjoy the moment, trying to create content out of it to distracting. Two, um, I wanted to keep this video PG. If you get, you get. And three, um, I just wanted to respect people's privacy. People are not really comfortable, which I don't blame them. I'm not either comfortable with seeing someone filming, especially the night night time or night life and all of that so people are not where they they are supposed to be so they don't want to be caught on camera or anything so because of that i couldn't film much but um it was fun hype men hype, hype men are becoming nuisance in this country um okay we went to 411 the 411 lounge we had dinner there then we went up to the club then after um, a while, we now went to Playhouse. And on both sides or in both venues, hype men are just, hype men are becoming users in this country, seriously. Like, I miss those days when we could just go to club and enjoy ourselves without hype men shouting over every music and saying stupid things like, oh, if you don't get money, come on here, there's the dog, go home. If you don't get money, I think all of that BS, like, Nightlife is still popping in Port Harcourt though. Nightlife is still popping in Port Harcourt. Like the whole of Jerry was busy. Cars everywhere. Of course, I didn't enter every place, but you would see cars in front of almost every lounge. Yes, we have limited options. We don't have a lot of options of where to go to uh, when you compare places like Lagos. I don't want to talk about Abuja. Places like Lagos. Uh, we don't have a lot of options but we're smaller in in number so we don't need a lot of places if there are too many places then clubs will be scanty so it's probably good that we don't have so i don't think we have up to five or six popping clubs in port harcourt i'm not sure we do i don't know i might be wrong but i i thought nightlife in port harcourt was dead seriously even though i went out i think three or four weeks ago and it was beer ban and paper is always crowded right but last night apart from the fact that i went to two different places i passed in front of a lot of places so i saw all the plenty of cars parked outside as we were talking 1 a.m 2 a.m not like 10 p.m so nightlife is still popular in Pazako. anyway guys i just hope this video is not this vlog is not too long if it's too long i'll have to cut it into two different parts um thank you so much for the love on my last video where Ruth and i answered questions sent in by friends love has have been massive if you've not seen that video you are missing out on the fun you need to go and watch that video i feel like that's the best video i've ever uploaded on youtube like i and funny enough i've still not watched the video like after it was edited i've not watched it but thank you all so much for the love and if you've not subscribed to my channel by now and this is not the first video my first video that i watched please what is the problem tell me tell me in the comment section what the problem is and i will try my possible best to fix it um thank you so much guys i'll see you in my next video bye